Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to create lists in HTML. Um, lists come into two different forms, ordered lists and unordered lists. Um, ordered lists are lists that they have numbers 1, 2, 3, 4 and so forth and unordered list is the same as the bullet list. Um, I have this template uh, for HTML that I have provided for you um, you can download it and work with it. We're going to work with the body, of course. Uh, always don't forget to change the title because this is going to be a uh, working on lists. I'm just going to put lists here. So coding HTML lists. And um, I'm going to go f save my file immediately, not to forget. So I'm going to go file, save as. And I'm going to call this lists dot html all right let's save it and i'm going to open it in the browser as well so all we see here is that text which we have it inside the body section i'm going to erase that one and start my list uh, first and foremost, we're going to work with unordered list, um, so UL for short. Uh, immediately close your tag not to forget it. So this is where my list is going to go. Um, the list items are going to sit here in between and they start with LI and close with LI. Um, I need to have more of these, so I just copy and paste it. So there you have it. I have three list items within my unordered list. Um, so here, for instance, I can just type different things. Like I can put, put green. I'm just going to go with colors. Red and black. I happen to have a space here. You don't really necessarily need that space between the tags and the text itself. So I'm just gonna save this and refresh my page. You see it's a very very simple bullet list, unordered list and um, that's how to create it. After that I'm just gonna put a heading here just to make it a little bit more organized. So I'm gonna put H1 and call it unordered list example alright so that is going to show like this um, I would like to create my ordered list here um, the same thing um, I am going to start with a heading just to label it properly so I'm gonna say or third list example close my tag and then I'm gonna start my ordered list here it's O L for short I'm gonna create my closing tag as well there you have it and create some space so we can put our list items here the same rule so L I for list and immediately you're going to close li oops it should be right here there you go forward slash li and then i'm going to duplicate this one so there you go uh, this is usually used for things that have a process a step-by-step -step process so um I'm, I'm just gonna talk about for instance fr uh, frying onions so I'm gonna say chop onions um, place them in a hot pan with some oil and fry them for a few minutes until 
take it brown there you go just something off the cuff and I'm going to save this one and now refresh our page there you have it we have steps one two three you can manipulate um, your lists a little bit as well there are things you can do with them so um, for instance uh, you can change um, the type of the list here instead of one two three for the ordered list you can have like alphabets all you need to do is to go inside the opening tag press a space put type equals quotations we're going to put an attribute here so attributes will sit inside the opening tag and they they work with equals and quotations uh, I'm just gonna put letter A here uh, I make it cap capital A there you go let's refresh this so now it's turned to ABC instead of one two three you can do that with Roman Roman numerals whatever you want I'm just I can change this one for instance to I lowercase i and then refresh it here there you go I have Roman numerals yeah so um, there are a bunch of things you can do with lists and this is a um, good example of it uh, I hope you enjoyed the video thank you very much for watching